Unveiling the Legacy, The Remarkable Children of President John Tyler John Tyler, the 10th President of the United States, led an intriguing personal life, marked notably by his extensive lineage. Fathering 15 children with two wives, Tyler's descendants have etched their own paths through American history, some shrouded in scandal, others in achievement, and a few in remarkable longevity. Here are 10 fascinating facets of the lives of Tyler's children, capturing the essence of their diverse experiences and contributions. Fact number 1. The Family Portrait. John Tyler, the 10th President of the United States, had a notably large family, fathering children with two wives over the course of his life. His first wife, Letitia Christian Tyler, bore him eight children. Together, they navigated the early years of their marriage amidst Tyler's burgeoning political career until Letitia's health declined, leading to her death in 1842 while Tyler was president. In 1844, Tyler remarried to Julia Gardner Tyler, a union that further expanded his family with seven additional children. This second marriage not only brought new members into the Tyler lineage but also reflected the social expectations and personal desires of the time, showcasing the blending of personal and political realms in the lives of America's early leaders. Number 2. The Confederacy's Patriots, Robert and David Tyler. Robert Tyler, 1816-1877, was not just a fervent supporter of the Confederacy but also played a crucial role as the Register of the Confederate Treasury. His position placed him at the heart of the Confederate financial apparatus during a time when the South's economic stability was paramount to its war efforts. Born in 1816, Robert's political and administrative career was significantly shaped by the Civil War, reflecting the deep-seated loyalties that divided the Tyler family, much like the rest of the nation. David Gardner Tyler, 1846-1927, nearly three decades younger than Robert, chose to directly engage in the conflict by joining the Confederate Army. His service during the Civil War was a testament to the family's alignment with Southern causes, despite the broader national turmoil. Born into a nation already fracturing along sectional lines, David's life and military service underscored the personal costs and commitments of the Tyler family during one of America's most divisive periods. Number 3. Lion Gardner Tyler, the Keeper of History. Lion Gardner Tyler, 1853 to 1935, stepping beyond the shadow of his father's controversial presidency, made significant contributions to American historical scholarship and education. His tenure as president of William and Mary College, from 1888 to 1919, was marked by a profound dedication to advancing education and preserving history. Lyon's efforts to rehabilitate his father's political legacy through meticulous historical research and writing offered a nuanced view of John Tyler's presidency, emphasizing the complexity of early American politics. His work illustrates the intellectual lineage of the Tyler family, bridging the gap between 19th-century political history and academic scholarship in the early 20th century. Number 4. The Tyler Twins, Unusual Timing the births of Mary and Elizabeth Tyler, twins in a time when such births were far less common and more perilous than today, add a unique layer to the Tyler family story. Their arrival into the world in the early 19th century, a period lacking in the medical advancements that would later significantly reduce the risks associated with multiple births, highlights both the personal joys and challenges faced by the Tyler family. Though specific details of their lives remain scarce, reflecting the era's limited documentation and the often overlooked stories of women in historical records, the twins symbolize the personal dimensions of historical figures' lives, which are frequently overshadowed by their public achievements and controversies. Number 5. Tazewell Tyler, a doctor in the making. Tazewell Tyler, 1830-1874, distinguishing himself from a family predominantly known for its political legacy, chose to pursue a career in medicine. Born during a period when medical practice was undergoing significant transformations, Tazewell's medical career was reflective of the broader changes in American society regarding healthcare and scientific understanding. His decision to become a doctor underscored the Tyler family's diverse interests and their engagements with professions that extended beyond the realm of politics and public service. While specific details of Tazewell's medical practice and contributions might be less documented, 
his career choice itself indicates the varied paths pursued by members of the Tyler family, embodying the 19th century spirit of exploration and innovation in various fields. Number 6. Julia Gardner Tyler, A Presidential Union. Julia Gardner Tyler, 1820-1889, becoming John Tyler's second wife in 1844, brought a unique blend of New York socialite charm and political acumen to the Tyler presidency. Born into a wealthy family on New York's Gardner's Island, Julia was well-educated and known for her beauty and social graces. Her marriage to John Tyler, following the tragic death of his first wife, Letitia, was not just a personal union but also a political alliance that helped Tyler navigate the complexities of his presidency. Julia and John Tyler's marriage resulted in seven children, enriching the Tyler lineage with descendants who continued to play roles in American society long after Tyler's presidency. Julia's influence extended beyond her role as a mother and first lady, she was actively involved in the social and political life of the era, making her an integral part of the Tyler family's legacy. Number 7. The Tragic Loss of Letitia Tyler Letitia Tyler, 1821-1907, not to be confused with John Tyler's first wife Letitia Christian Tyler, led a life marked by the personal tragedies that were all too common in the 19th century. The loss of and contest Tyler in infancy and Alice Tyler at the young age of 23 are stark reminders of the era's high mortality rates and the fragility of life. These personal losses within the Tyler family highlight the harsh realities faced by families during a time when medical knowledge and practices were still in their nascent stages. Such tragedies underscored the challenges of 19th century life, even for families in the highest echelons of society, and serve as poignant reminders of the personal dimensions behind historical figures' public personas. Number 8. John Tyler III, Following in Grandfather's Footsteps John Alexander Tyler, 1848-1883, inheriting a strong political lineage, ventured into the realms of law and politics, aiming to carry forward the legacy established by his grandfather, President William Henry Harrison, and his father, President John Tyler. Born into a period of burgeoning American expansion and division, John Alexander's life represented the potential continuation of a family deeply embedded in the nation's political fabric. However, his untimely death at the age of 35 marked a premature end to what could have been a significant political journey, echoing the fragility and unpredictability of life in the 19th century. His endeavors in law and initial forays into politics underscore a bridging of generational legacies, highlighting the enduring influence of the Tyler Harrison lineage. Number 9. The Legacy Lives On, Modern Descendants The longevity of President John Tyler's lineage is strikingly illustrated by Lion Gardner Tyler Jr., 1924-2020, and Harrison Ruffin Tyler, born 1928, whose lifespans extend into the 21st century. Their existence, spanning nearly two centuries since their grandfather's birth in 1790, is a testament to the remarkable endurance of the Tyler family's legacy. Living into an era vastly different from that of their grandfather's presidency, these grandsons serve as living connections to early American history, embodying the continuity and change experienced by the nation over the decades. Their lives not only reflect the personal stories within a historically significant family but also underscore the broader narrative of American progress and transformation. Number 10. The Diverse Destinies of John Tyler's Lesser-Known Children in addition to the varied and vibrant lives of the Tyler children previously mentioned, the destinies of the remaining six weave further complexity into the family tapestry. These siblings, not as frequently spotlighted, nonetheless contributed their own chapters to the Tyler legacy. Elizabeth Tyler Waller's life was cut tragically short at 26 due to childbirth, a somber reminder of the era's harsh realities. John Tyler, Jr. and Letitia Tyler Semple dedicated themselves to service, with John taking up arms in the Civil War and Letitia pioneering in education after a challenging marriage. Alice Tyler Dennison's life also ended prematurely, adding a note of tragedy to the family story. Tazewell Tyler's battle with post-war trauma and subsequent personal struggles underscore the lasting impacts of conflict. Lastly, David Gardner Tyler, blending law and public service, echoed the Tyler commitment to governance and legal affairs. Together, these six lives encapsulate the breadth of experience and challenge faced by President Tyler's progeny, each contributing to the rich mosaic of American history in their unique way.